Hi everyone! In this video I'll show how the buyer prolonged the key to the existing license of WSSH Tunnel Manager on your own. You can find the key to the license in the folder B. It's called SSHM key. What should you do if you don't have the key? I'll delete it to show you. You need to launch the program and then the pop-up appears with an option to generate a new key. After being generated, a key appears in the folder bin. Here it is. But only you know the key and you need to sign in with it at least for the first time. It should be done because the authorization server should recognize it. You'll be definitely kicked out of the program, but you'll be able to prolong the time of the key usage. Now you can see another pop-up where it's written that the key hasn't been found and that you should start manager by key.exe. Here you can see prices in bitcoins. After that notification, the program shuts down, but we have the key. So go to Manager by Key, run it, choose English. For purchasing the license, you need to enter your email address. I'll use a temporary one. I insert the email address into the input field and opt for a period of usage. The price depends on the period of time. The more days you pay for, the lower the price per day is. By moving the slider, you can clarify the price and choose the best option. The annual license costs $500. For instance, you've chosen 61 days. Then press Buy. After that, the program connects to the authorization server And in approximately 10 minutes, you get an email with payment details. Here you see a notification about receiving an email during a day. Actually, it comes in 5 to 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, there is an email where it's written that for prolonging the key for 61 days, you need to pay the invoice in bitcoins. The key will be prolonged when there is a confirmation in the bitcoin system. That's all here. Don't forget to make a copy of the key after buying it, as you'll be able to insert it into a new program and it'll work.